Hi there. So just give you a moment to pause the video and uh, give you time to read the question. And in a few moments, I'll come back and go through the solution. OK, so let's see how you got on. Well, first of all, let's just recap from part A. We had to find gf of x and if you looked at part A, we found that gf of x was equal to 3x. We've now got to do a similar thing and work out fg of x. So if we start by doing that, we've got fg of x. Well, that's going to be equal to f of whatever g of x was. And we can see that g of x was 3 times the natural log of x. And all I need to do now is substitute 3 times the natural log of x for any x in f of x. So that's going to mean that we get e to the power 3 times the natural log of x. And what I do next is use the power rule for logs. When I've got a 3 in the front here, I can rewrite that as being equal to e to the power the natural log of x cubed. Should be familiar with that rule. Now that we've got e to the natural log of some function of x, we should know that the result is that function of x. We get that this equals x cubed. OK? So we've now got gf of x and fg of x, and so we can equate them. So if we put that down, we've got that 3x must be equal to x cubed. So it's just a question of solving this equation. And so what I'm going to do is next subtract 3x from both sides and rearrange. If I do that, I end up with x cubed minus 3x equals 0. And now I can factorise this, pull out x as a common factor, and I get this line. And then either x equals 0 or the other factor x squared minus 3 would equal 0. Now, I know that x can't equal 0. It's got to be a value greater than 0 because you can't take the natural log of 0. So, Therefore, if we have that x has got to be greater than 0, it means that from this equation here, if we add 3 to both sides, x squared must equal 3. And if I take the square root to both sides, x would normally equal plus or minus root 3. But I'm taking the positive value because we know that x has to be greater than 0, and you can't take the natural log of a negative value. It's undefined. So there's our answer, x equals root 3. Okay?